Hey, hey everyone, this is Shark89, welcome back to my YouTube channel, I'm back on Farming Simulator 19, and I'm back for my second episode of Rogue River. This is it guys, I'm going to start doing my logging series with this one, okay? Uh, I want to show you guys real quick what i got going on. Um, let's see... Time scale, we need to back that out to real time. Um, economy, normal. Um, everything else, uh, here are my settings there. Um, but the uh, big thing I wanted to point out was economy is normal, and also if you take a look at my monies, I've got the standard 500,000 uh, USD. So I'm not going to be using a money mod in this series. I'm going to try to buy everything outright and uh, you know kind of be economical with my uh, money. All right, sorry about that little glitch there, but uh, yeah, I've, I'm starting off with $500,000. Uh, my economy is normal, and uh, that's how we're going to do it. All right, let's go into the map and see where I want to start logging first. Um, so, my introduction video, there's, you know, 15 landings here. Um, so, I'm just going to try to find something that's going to be the best value for me. Looks like that one's about 105. We'll go up in price, depending on where you go. Uh, 207, 213, 175 for number six. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let's just do that then. How much is the road? 6,000. So I'll buy the road and the landing. Yes. Yes. Okay. So I got landing number six and the road leading up to the landing. So I'm going to take this down to the shop and sell it. And then actually get some legitimate uh, equipment here. Even though, Chad, I do like the uh, little truck you gave us, I'm going to sell it to give me some more money. Let's see. Art. I can sell it for $27,888. So, bam. My tool has been sold. All right, so how much money do I have? I've got about three hundred fifty thousand dollars. All right, uh, forestry machines, Mister FDR logging truck, uh, one hundred twenty-five thousand to at least or to purchase. I feel like this is one of those trucks that I'll just buy it. Okay, go back. We're gonna lease a low boy. Back, we're gonna lease a processor. Lease this guy. Here's my power clamp. Here we go. Lease. Oops. Nope. Nope. Back. Lease that guy. Okay. I'm thinking, do I need anything else? I really don't want to do a forwarder without FDR having one. I may have to, though. Hmm. Let's go fell some trees and then go from there. All right. So I decided to go with the FDR truck, um, Kenworth, because uh, I know, or at least I've been told, it's going to be able to get up the hills a lot easier than a lot of the other trucks. So even though I like my Warrior Semi a lot, uh, I think we're going to have to uh, keep it out of this map here. That definitely seems legit right there, right? Why not? Take a left and then a right. All 
All right, here's number six, my friends. Number six. Now, I'm probably going to need a skitter later on uh, to uh, do things, but uh, I'm going to do some processor felling, if that makes any sense. Oops, wrong way. So I know I'm not going to need this cat for, oops, for a minute. And what I'll do is I'll plop the plow down so I could use it with my processor. Got the blade finally on. That was a fiasco and a half. All right, I'm going to move my truck now. Out of the way. I'm just going to park it up on the land, up here on the road. Kind of in the bush, out of the way. All right, so um, plan of action. I think what I'm going to do is, I think I own all of this. Uh, I might get snagged up a little bit. Yeah, no, I own all that up to the snag. So I'm going to clear the trees up along this rock here so I can extend my landing a little bit. And I think I'm going to make my road a little wider um, just so it's a little easier. I can stage equipment a little bit better off out of the way. Um, so yeah. Let me take care of that real quick, and uh, we'll see you soon. All right, so I want to see if this thing will actually plow. Oh, yep, looks like it will. Cool. So you can make your own custom plow roads, which is fine. Cool. I like it. Not that I'm going to sit here and plow this entire landing with my uh, processor, but it definitely helps.
think I have cleared what I want to clear. Wow, that's steep. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get a machine down that. Guess we'll find out, huh? We shall see. Alright, um... I'm going to go get a log trailer. And then we're going to collect all of these logs, because I just don't want them sitting um, on the end of my road. There's a little glimpse of all my progress. Not that many trees on the ground, but enough to be able to do the job. I'm going to dump this trailer over here by the store. When I decide to bring up some more equipment, it will be staged for me. So we'll just leave it there. And let's get a short trailer, short bed trailer. Short log trailer. Uh, we can lease it for $1,100. So let's do that. So basically the only piece of equipment that I actually own right now is my Kenworth uh, truck. Everything else is kind of leased. I think I'll keep it kind of like Grizzly Mountain as far as the trailers go. I'll keep those leased. Um, and then I will uh, purchase the equipment as I get the money. Um, yeah, that's going to require me to bring things to and from and all this other fancy stuff, but I'll take care of that um, off camera, or off recording, I should say, so I don't have to bore you guys to tears with that. Hello. Um, yeah. So, But I'll try to keep you guys updated every time I purchase a new machine uh, with the money that I have. This is kind of squirrely, but I think it's just something you used to get getting used to. Just a different map. Ah, come on, go on. Stop, 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 stop. It's okay, I meant to do that. Oh, no. Ah, oh, man, I can't believe I did that. Alright, I know I don't have enough for an actual load, but um, I will... Uh, I just want to clean up a little bit. That's really all. I just want to clean. Sensitivity needs to come down to 100.
kind of getting kind of squirrely here. Um, my tracks are definitely not flat. Um, so that's one thing that stinks about this uh, particular map in general, just because it's uh, the, the terrain is a little different. Um, the You can see how badly my um, my loader here is rocking around. Now, uh, granted, I could probably put it in a better position and I would be a whole lot safer, but uh, yeah. Oh my gosh. Let's not lose that one. So, and it seems like um, there's some FPS loss going on. FPS loss. Oh no, going on here. Something I'm definitely going to have to dig into. Yeah, this is just... Maybe if I pull up a little bit. Wow, look at this. So, keeping my logs unstrapped, they moved. Probably because I drove with them unstrapped. <laughs> That's okay, nothing to load or can't fix. Alright, so, yeah, that was definitely, um, a little interesting, as far as the loading goes. It's definitely different than what I'm used to, um, probably because I'm used to flat ground, but, um, yeah, no, other than that, I think it's alright. So, uh, I think that's gonna do it for me on this one. I'm just gonna park this up here, up out of the way. And then I think the next episode, I'm going to... That may not be a great location for that. Anyway, I think next episode what I'll do is... Um, maybe grab a skitter. And maybe make an actual logging road out of this instead of just this dirt road. But, uh, yeah. That's my plans. So legit. Uh, thanks for hanging out. If you liked the video, toss it a like. Uh, if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. And uh, I look forward to bringing you more content oof, here with this uh, Rogue River stuff. And uh, I will see you guys later. Peace.